I'm Dave. I'm Steve. I'm Dad. And I'm Son. Welcome to that episode of DJ Projects' it's Wednesday special. So this week at DJ Projects, it's going to be a really exciting one because it's going to run into the Sundays episode. We have got two drives really close to each other. One of them you've already seen, and one of them is going to be brand new to you. We're going to get the drone up for you to show you how close it is. We've got two teams going out, and we're just going to smash it out. So if you'd like to like the video, don't forget to like it at the end if you don't want to like it at the beginning. Subscribe if you're brand new, and comment down below. Let's get to it. So here we are, guys. We are on site with James's. Stevie is up the road, just uh, prepping that one for us. I'm going to move on there. Finn's been crushing away. We've got all the kit on here today. But I've been buying. I knew it was going to be cold this week. So I've been to Alder, bought a little heated seat. We'll probably do with it on a dumper. And we'll see if we can fit it on a dumper. I bet we can fit it on a dumper. She's got a scrap lighter socket and that one has as well so we have to keep uh, Finn's bum nice and warm as well basically today it's going to be get as much cushion as possible done with this drive drag it up see get some levels in place and then when Stevie's done that one up there he's bringing all the concrete from that drive up there down here tipping it here and we're going to crush that as well and we're going to use all recycled gear on both drives but I'm going to fit this seat and then we're going to crack on so here we have it, and it's starting to get warm. I think once it beds in, I think it protects the seats a little bit, won't it? So, bums on seats, nice and warm. Finn's over there smashing it out with that pile. I'm gonna nip over there in a minute. Uh, just get rid of the truck out of the way, and then we'll see what we could do. We've got to mix shift these as well. I'll do it with a pallet truck, or I'll do it with a sanding, lift them up. James just shifting that wood, so we can start clearing all that. But yeah, it's good and guys, it really is a good one. Can't wait to get my teeth stuck into this one and really smash it out of the park. Hello guys, you've been seeing what my dad and Finn have been doing throughout the day. Um, we're going to jump from back to back, all video basically, but let me just show you. It's going to be a new driveway here, new pathway down there. I believe it's a resin one. Oh, look at that. But mine and Scott's first job, we need to take these slabs up. So that is basically what we're going to be doing. Big electric gate as well. Absolutely massive. That's what you want, guys. But yeah, what we'll do, we'll leave a pathway for the customers if needed. But yeah, let's get to taking some slabs. We're going to start down there and work our way out. As you can see, sand bed, getting some on the wagon. The springs are still smiling, so that's always a good sign. We do not want to be overweight, of course we don't. But yeah, this is what we're doing. Freezing. What? Like it's your rollers. <laughs> they are actually called your rollers. 
Edgings are all coming up guys, so don't worry about if you see them coming up. We're going to leave them in for now, but they are all coming up. Trip two, that one. I'm just going to drop that down the road. Scott will probably just lift up a few slabs. I'll only be around about five, ten minutes. And yeah, we'll be straight back here, guys. So I said, I'll be here with my dad. And I'm here. But he wants his phone because it needs to connect it to the Sanit. So, yeah, boy. Get a hammer, a bolster, something like that on these bad boys. Are we ready for the crusher? But now, it's back to Scott. Slabs are gone. And obviously it's about four inch of decent-ish sort of sand here. So what we're doing, we're just raking it down. We're gonna take that pile, put it in there, put a pile over there. And then once we've done that everywhere, this crumbly tarmac stuff here, look, we're gonna, uh, ah, we're gonna get some of this up, chuck it, and then my dad can stay down that way in the sun. We may as well do something like this though. keep on showing you the same thing so we're just going to put a packer on there break them up with a packer and then carry on working our way through this probably got about 15 ton done at the minute stevie's brought all the slabs over there jordan's just bringing the dumper over yeah it is big and we've got all that to do as well
right, we've got some good sand here, guys. It's not bad. It's not bad. I'd say we've got maybe one and a bit ton or so. Bit of a rubbish pile over here. You can see now it's starting to get a bit stony on top, so we don't want them in the mixers, of course. But yeah, a bit tiring, but big bit of sand. You can't really tell the difference because obviously it's sand on sand, but you can sort of see we've, we've done a big pile there. Nah. See what we can do down there where the digger can't get to. If we can sort of clear that to edge here, I'll be happy with that because then the digger can get all of this easily. So we'll see what we can do up there. So we've just been shoveling, going for around about a shovel below ground. So if anything, I probably dug a little bit too much there so we can have a little bit back in um because it's going to be stone a full shovel basically almost so done this bit scotty to what it's time to go across there get rid of all of that and then we'll just go again guys simple 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 it's a little bit backwards not using a digger i know some people are going to say that but at the same time it saves my dad having to come back up whilst me and scott have sort of done everything we can here let's just start digging out Old school, hey, before they had diggers. So let's get it. Progress ain't fast, but it's a bonus because we're ahead of schedule because we won't be doing this normally. So, ka -ching! So I'm just gonna lift that pallets up if I can with the digger. Fins carrying on crushing, clearing the way through the pile. Jordan just got the dumper stuck. He's all right now. Yeah, he's all right. Move the dumper. I'm gonna set up now, bring the digger down and move these two pallets for James. So that didn't go to plan, they were a little bit heavier than what I thought. I think the 1.2. So about 800 kilo, the uh, sunny will lift. So just a bit too much. So pallet truck tomorrow, finish jump back on the crusher. We're gonna try and get the crusher across here to get rid of it now. Yeah, and then it's nearly wrapping up time. Good morning. It's a cold one. Really, really is a cold one. Just done the pre-morning checks on the sunny. Just check the oil, make sure the oil's all right. Uh, knit around it, it's warming it up now. Get ready, leave it idling for a little while just to warm it up. Get me heated seat on because that works really well. I had to turn it off yesterday, it's getting too hot. But what we're doing today, we are taking this sunny up the road and digging that one out. I've just dropped Finn off at that job, the job where Stevie and Scott were yesterday. Oh, it's froster, it really is froster. Yeah, so I've dropped Finn up there. Finn's just uh, digging a little tiny bit where the steps are, where Stevie left for the customer. I'm going to take the sunny up there, we're going to dig the rest of it out. Jordan's come in with the grab today, he's going to grab the muck away. And then we are going to transport some of the crushed hardcore from this job up to that job. Get that all stoned up and ready. Probably won't be stoned up all today, but Stevie's on quotes. So when Stevie's on quotes, him and Scott are coming down. Probably doing some hydraulic coil in that. Just a little top of hydraulic coil in the, the old sunny. But yeah, going to warm this up, we'll track this up the road and carry on with our day. 
The diggers here. Thing smashed that bit of a corner out. He's absolutely cracked on. Dug that out. Plan is then we'll move all this spoil, push that sand up, move all this spoil over there and start digging this bit. And then what we'll have to do, move a bit back and dig that bit final. But I'm going to give Jordan a ring as well, see what his uh, whereabouts is for the grab. So we've shifted all the soil over. Now nah, we're going to dig this down to spec all the way down there, watching that cable when obviously Finn's got the NCL out of the way. Virgin. Yeah, this one should be nice and quick. Just got to wait for Jordan. Jordan's coming about 12 o'clock, so we've got plenty of time to crack on with this. Some good progress. That's the gas pipe, electric cable for the electric gates, and that's the cable for the little lamps. Just have to be careful around here, there's a lot of stuff going off in this corner. There's a lot of bricks in the ground. It looks like someone's made it like a soakaway or something, very fashion soakaway. So we'll skim all them top ones off, make sure we get the roller and give it a good rolling vibration. So no sinkage on this drive. We are running out of space. Those who say this digger's probably too big for this drive, but my other digger is stuck on another job, so I've had to bring this one. But yeah, we'll get it done. We'll definitely get it done. A bit of a standstill now. Just waiting for Jordan. This is all down to spec. Let's get rid of this so I can carry on, and then we can start stoning it back up again. It's cold, isn't it, mate? Yeah. It's cold when we stood around, really cold. But Jordan shouldn't be long now. So Jordan is here, just grabbing it through us now. See you on time lapse, get it grabbed on. So that's the receiver wire for the electric gate, which goes there. You can get cordless ones or Wi-Fi ones now. That's dead, dead, dead careful. We haven't pulled it out or anything. So just tucked it up out of the way. Now we can just grab the rest of that. About half a bag of stone Jordan's grabbed up. So we're going to use that here. But yeah, it's coming along nicely. We're nearly at depth now. Sand we're going to reuse for blocks. Jordan's about full. Yeah, we're going to get some of that hardcore from uh, Dan James's. So what we're going to do with that cable, I'm just going to put a bit of sand on it. So when we put the stone over the top of it, it don't damage that cable. I mean, it was just in the tarmac before. A bit more protection on it now.
So there we have it. That's how we do it. So Dayton Point garage. Can't change that, so you've got to stick to that. Same with this side, can't change it, got to stick to it. Road, within an inch, 40 mil, you can swap, because you're going to be putting a bit of a curb brace in there with tarmac. So you can change that a little bit. Don't really need to that much. Finn's on the go now, he's going to put a line up. So once you've got that data point there, that data point, string a line straight through, and then you work from this line to the other line, exactly the same on that side, and that'll give us levels. And then what we do, 50 mil below the line, give it a good whack. And then that's enough to put the edging stones around. And then if we do need to build it up a little bit more, we can put a bit more in. It's not far off where it used to be looking at it, with the line and the marks on the, it's not far off. We've still got to take that bit out there. But we've left that just for the customer, just so they can get in and out just in case we don't get it stoned up because traffic's a nightmare at the minute. I think the kids are back at school. So Jordan's going to go and get some hardcore, some stone. So we're just going to wait for him, just sit these lines up. A quick five minutes and he should be here. It's Jordan's swap wagons now. And then he's going to drop some stone down from his, like say, his string lines are up. We're all ready for him. There we have it. Just wants all whack in there. Probably need another six, seven ton. Just got that bit down there, but it's nice and safe where the door is. But yeah, me and Finn will smash this out tomorrow. Some not serious progress. But next time you see me, I'll be back in the yard. I said we'll catch back up at the yard. Come on, mate. You want... I can't go anywhere, no. Why? <laughs> My keys have gone. <laughs> 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 said we'll catch back up at the yard. And yes, it has been oh, just a week of digging for me. Mm. Just feels like a week of digging. But we've made some serious progress. We've worked as a team, as always. Yep. But if you do want to see a bit more of the drive, not completion, but do you want to see a bit more of the drive, it's going to have to catch back up on the Sunday episode. Yep. I also forgot to show you how much we dug out, but it was just past the door. So yeah. And it's near stoned up now, so. Oh, have you stoned it? Yeah, stoned it. Oh, you've shown them then? Yeah. Oh yeah, you've seen it then, yeah, my bad. Yeah. Uh, puppy update, he's here. <laughs> he's growing. He's growing. Definitely Still small. growing. But yeah, that's another Wednesday special yep. completed. All done Hope you busted. enjoyed this episode. If you have, it drop us a like. Don't forget to comment down below. We'll see you in the next one, guys. Mm -hmm.